Hey everybody, Connie Bobsters, and today we're doing a two for McDoofer. That's correct. We're doing a quest mod, and we've got a um, dirty shack we're going to be visiting. Uh, so we're going to be we're finally taking a look at Courier's Cache. Uh, I've been putting it off for a very long time, reviewing god awful mods when I should have just been doing this. So we're not going to be looking at any armors or weapons because Courier's Cache has quests and weapons. It is so sexy. I actually have never played it, so I don't know. But, let's get started. Uh, the second mod we're going to be... Um, Mama. Oh, God, I just broke Mama's pelvis. Oh, sh... Um, okay, I'm not going to... Hello? Install some stairs. No wonder Mom, Mama broke her fucking pelvis, because she... Install some stairs. Hello? Well, well, well. Damn it. Ew! Did meat come out of it? Ew! Ew! Um... Where are you? You sexy little scrapper? Hello? Someone told me someone would be waiting. Uh oh. Um... Ah, what happened to your f Hello? Oh, have you come to laugh at me? Yeah, I've come to laugh at you. I've come to break your fucking- Oh my god! Uh, Jesus. Oh, god. Damn it, dude. Uh, who are you? Oh, my name is Jimmy, but everyone calls me the Elephant Man, but I don't mind. What is wrong with your head? I was born like this. Mama loved Tommy more than me. He had a normal head. I'm glad the mod author only did the first line. Tommy? Tommy is my younger brother. He died. I, I'm, like I said, I'm, I'm very glad the mod author only did the first line. Are you feeling okay? I'm okay, I guess. Are you here to mock my head? Yeah, and your armor too, you... Jesus, I'm feeling quite pleased with the shape of my head. I look like shit. Wait, I look like shit, or you look like shit? Who looks like shit? I'm thoroughly confused. I'm feeling I look like shit. You're lucky you don't look like me. Yeah, well, maybe we could take that baseball back and fix... Where, where, where are you from? I'm from around the Red Rock Canyon area on top of a mountain. Safe form, getting mocked by your kid. Wait, what? By your kind. Okay. You want to come travel with me, you... Bastard. Hey, can we go to the bank? No. No. Keep your big head out of sight. Let's trade. Wait. Where's, um... Your head is making me sick. I'm gonna go. Hey, keep your big at head out of sight. Okay, one of these is leave, and one of these is wait. And I don't... Okay. I don't have much, though. You spelled low raw, you dick. Uh, okay. You don't have a weapon? Here, take mine. It's been... Ugh. I don't even want to touch this gun now because it's seen you. Uh, okay. Um... East energy cells. That's what you use, don't you? Here. Just leave... Your head is making me sick. I'm gonna go. Oh. Okay. Now, this whole area isn't nav-meshed, which is, um, helpful. Uh, so we're supposed to fast travel in order for him to follow us. But I don't know... I'm guessing he's following. Hello, friend. Shut up! Do not call me a friend, you potato sack bastard. Jesus Christ. Pancake Man from Rockwell Pursuit looks like a goddamn movie star compared to you. Jesus. I'm, I'm going. I'm going. Aww. Yeah, if you want to follow us, just follow us, okay? We're going... We're going to look at some beautiful mods... Just, if you want to come, just, just follow us, okay? So, uh, we're gonna fast teleport, that's what it's called, not fast travel. And, uh, we're gonna go over there, and I'm actually gonna go to Trance's map, see if he is in fact following us, because I cannot tell, because it's, um, the, I don't know. And is he here? Oh, great. Wonderful. Listen, Janet, I, um, I just want you to know, I am very attractive, and if you need some confirmation, just look 
just look at that elephant man. Just look. Jerry is staring into his eyes. Jerry, don't look directly in his eyes. Jerry, I don't want your face growing out of proportion. We're gonna, we're gonna have two jack-o'-lanterns if that happens. Oh, God. Really? Now? Really? Really? Do you see what I have with me? Get out of here! I, I don't have time for this. We're... Every time we try to review something, guys, just legion, just get away from me. Jesus. Oh my god. Here, here, there's a fucking. Don't. This, this is my wife. God. Tell Kaiser to suck a dick. Okay, let's go. Jesus Christ. Kaiser. Kaiser, Kaiser, Kaiser. Every, every time we review something. God damn it. This better be a good mod. I hope Elephant Man dies. Steve! Steve, don't show him your ass. Come on. I don't have any guns. Watch out, everyone. Freak show coming through. I got a walking circus here. Meet the talking rad roach. The, the death claw with the hat. The ghoul that walks. And the man who has a pancake. No, you know, you're pumpkin head. You're not even a pancake. Okay. Janet, could you like... Janet, just watch out. I don't have a gun. I gave it to that guy because it's gross. Hello? Oh, yeah, this is... Oh, shit. Oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dear Bruce Willis. Die hard bag. Die hard outfit. Ah. Remember when we first met John McClane? Something, something, something on a plane. Something, 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 something. I forgot the song, yeah. There was a fan song about Bruce Willis a while back. Oh, yeah, look at me. Oh, God, I am so muscly. Sweet Jesus. This is going to be a sexy review. I guess John McClane didn't like radios either. You hear that radio? <clears throat> <clears throat> You're lucky this time. I'll just suffocate you with this money. Shh, it'll be over soon. Shh, baby. Shh, shh. He's dead. Hey, there's other stuff over here. Ew, 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 ew. Cuddles, get out of the way. Ew, ew. Uh, Charlie, letter to Carlos. Okay, we got two letters. And it's really easy to read them because this is in Skyrim. Oh, 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 sweet Jesus, Skyrim, I hate you. Okay, stash toolbox. Look how clean it is. Although my screwdriver looks like a wedding ring. WSE cigarette. Courier's cash. WSE. They don't go together very well. Okay. Um, what does WSE stand for? Oh! <gasps> Oh, look at me! Smoking kills, kids. Do not follow my example. Unless it's a candy cigarette. Then you can mock the kids that smoke. Yeah. And wear a rebreather. Oh, I have a wedding ring. Somewhere. Wait, sorry. I just want to look at it. Which arm is it on? Oh, it's on the puffy arm. Look at that puffy arm. It's so sexy. Puff, puff. I heard you were looking for a man. A man who had a pumpkin face. A man you could never look at. Oh, God, Jesus. Ew. Looks like a pickle's coming out of your friggin' face. Yeah, welcome to Fraggle Rock. We're gonna bash your head in. Uh, let's read these notes real quick before I forget forever. Dear Bruce, I think Carlos has finally flipped his fucking lid, you know? Always talking about wanting to be a badass rogue ranger of some sort. This is to Bruce. Okay. If he gets his grubby mitts on the shit we found here, it's only gonna encourage him. And if he goes off trying to enforce the law, he's just gonna get himself waxed. Fuck if I care. But I'd rather not join the idiot. I say we ditch this d desert, sell this stuff to some traders at the Mojave Outpost, and retire in the comfort of my friend Free NGR territory. My raiding days are over. It's getting too stressful for me. I'm getting too old for this shit. I'm always worried Carlos is going to put a shotgun in my back. You know, you should be too. Party. Party on, old friend. Charlie. Letter to Carlos. Hey, Carlos. Me and the Charlie kid done turned this place over. Wait. wait. Bruce. Okay, th this is to Bruce. 
from Charlie, and this is a letter to Carlos from fuck you. Okay. Hey, Carlos. Me and the Charlie kid done turned this place over. We grabbed some lovely little out of town. Uh, we, 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 we grabbed some lovely little loot while that courier was out of town. Thanks for marking the location like you did. I might not have found this shithole otherwise. I did as you asked too. When we, he was done looting, I stuck a 12 gauge in Charlie's, Charlie boy's back. More loot for us and he was a useless shit anyway. If you got get this note, it means I'm ahead of you. We'll meet up north in that nice home you found so we can split the spoils of your, our thievery. If you don't mind having to go at the fucking toolbox, I couldn't get it open. Just sounds like some wrenches in there, but I don't think it'd be locked. That tight. Oh, God, I burped. Uh, if there wasn't anything good in it. Lots of love. Fuck you. That's it. Alright, looks like uh, Carlos is a little bitch. Turned on his friends that didn't like him in the first place, so technically it doesn't matter. You dealing drugs over there? Sheriff Sheriff Dun Sheriff Dunsby, are you deal dealing drugs? I think Sheriff Dunsby's dealing drugs. I know his name's not Dunsby, shut up. Okay, uh I thought that was ball arms for a got a second. What did I just say? I thought that was ball arms for a second. There we go, much better. Mm. Ooh, I got scared. Okay. I need to get Geronimo back. I keep Loading my game up and then forgetting and then all of that. All right, everyone, act normal. Impossible. Really wish I had a gun. Should have prepared for this more. No, no, whole whole mod's gonna have guns in it. I don't need I don't need a gun. Idiot. There was a wedding. Oh God. Gotta be a gun lying here somewhere. This is Fallout. And then, my answers were prayed. Shit. Maybe if I throw the bullets at them really hard. Fisticuffs. I do have my wedding ring on. I can punch them. And they'll get like little, little break marks in their noses and such. Hello? I'm very heavily armed. I think Carlos is gonna be in here. Ooh, this is pretty cool. Nothing. Damn it. No! Okay, good. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, wait. Okay. I just wanna search around real quick. Maybe see if we can go up the ladder. We might be able to if we get up there. Okay. A little generator. This is a nice little house. This is pretty cool. <gasps> Alright, people. I'm gonna lock this. Pick it. Lock, pick it. And then we're gonna burst in there and kill every living thing. Excluding ourselves. Just, just give me... There we go. Perfect. It's gonna be crowded in there. Hello? <gasps> Moist nuggets. Good. Give me that nugget, girl. Look. Oh, it's so sexy. Mmm. What? What, what, what? What? I, something gone. Sorry. What else we got? Anything? Wooden crate, wooden crate, wooden crate. Hello? Anyone? A raider has betrayed his friend, stolen your belongings, and gone north of Vegas. Find him. Carlos is nowhere to be seen. There must be something here that will lead me to his whereabouts. So, uh, when you start up the mod... Oh, that's a sweet laptop. Oh, God. It's in my face. Uh, so when you do start up the, uh... The mod, you get a little note, and it's like, Oh, you got shot in the head. You forgot some things, you little goof. And then you, you go on the adventure. Also, this mainly works with, uh... There's a patch, so you have to... There's... This is mainly, uh, use the armors and such for, like, the modified bodies, like breezes and type 9s, and I never use those because I don't like... I just don't like them. Body mods are not my thing. I don't care about them. It's too much mixing and matching. 
This is a really cool laptop, though. And I hate that whenever I do that. It does that now. Choose an item. Oh, that's awesome. Cool. Sweet. Okay, go up there in a second. Let's just look around. Oh, new beginnings, you say? Well, then. Oh, oh it's a light. I thought it was going to flush. Ooh. This is a really cool little house. Oh, shesh, get bought. Oh, God. Okay. Broke some bone. Oh, I found a gun. Moist Nugget Obrez. Oh, this one's this one's got a name. It's like a personality. No, it's a different specification, you idiot. Okay. This one, uh, Iron Sights, or the, uh... It's different. How about we go with that? Okay. Uh, let's see. Nothing else? Let's read that note. New beginnings. It, is it ironic that the first two criminals to face justice at the hand of Carlos were the same two men that once spread anarchy with him? No more ironic, I believe, than that a man who is a lawbringer is a hero when he kills a man, yet a man who is a criminal is a villain when he kills a man. For this reason, Carlos has chosen to finally pursue Carlos's dream of becoming a ranger who brings justice to a lawless land. Bruce and Charlie helped Carlos find the armor that would accompany his new beginning, and for that, Carlos says gracias. Their deaths were the baptism of Carlos. But they found more armor than one man could wear, and there is no sense for Carlos to wear more outfit than one, for all must recognize and fear him without delay. So Carlos has chosen to sell his extra clothing to raise money for the purchase of law-bringing firearms and roses for the chicas. The first man to buy from Carlos was a burdened muchacho outside of the Crimson Caravan. What he does with his new attire is his business. Carlos does not care unless his activity brings injustice. For then Carlos will kill this man and resell the clothing. Rapido, the wastes are ripe with justice. Dun dun dun. This mod, lead, this mod needs like little uh, guitar. Bling, bling, bling. Carlos. 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 Let's go here. Hmm. Muchachos and chicas, muchachos and chicas, I hope you're not spreading injustice. Chip, Carlos, Carlito, and his way. Oh God, sorry. Hey there, friend. I'm Chip. What brings you down to this here area of lovely old Nevada? Uh, I had some things in storage that were stolen. I'm trying to track them down. Say, nice clothes. Well, I wish you luck in that. I do. Now, if you don't mind, something just came up. Is it your penis? And I have to be on my way. It's your penis. Don't leave just yet, not before you tell me where you got that fancy outfit. Where'd I get them? Well, uh, uh, I got them from, because they're my clothes, right? I got them from me since they're mine. That's where I got them. Uh-oh. Well, fair enough. Have a good day. Is that right? You know, that looks like an outfit that belonged to a courier I knew once. Courier? Hell yeah, man. I done some curring before. Uh, some curring. Some cur couriering before. Hell yeah. Have you ever had curry? I bet you have. What's the last delivery you made? The last delivery? Yeah. Well, uh, you see, it was a special delivery. To this here Crimson Caravan behind us. Okay. They contacted me personally, cause they done heard I's the best courier around. They asked me to deliver a very sensitive package. Okay. I told them I'd have to charge a whole buttload of caps, and they said, Chip, you're the best. We'll pay you right. In fact, I had to charge them so many caps that they didn't even have enough to pay me yet. I gotta come back next week, and if they still don't have the caps, you'll be looking at the new owner of the Crimson Caravan. So yeah, that's why I don't have any caps on me. Not because I just bought these clothes, if that's what you're thinking. It takes a tough man to be a cur in this part of the desert. Ain't that the truth? 
let me give you some advice. If you see anyone out there in the waist dressed like this, they're likely to not be as kind as myself. They're probably a raw hide chewing, radioactive ranger type bad butt mother trucker. And all the ladies on the strip are sure to know it too. So if you don't mind, I really gotta be getting to the girls now. Chicas. I do mind, actually. Carl sold you that outfit after he stole it from me, and I'm done being nice. Can I, like, I hope I get options. I hope I can either buy it, intimidate him, or sweet talk him. Son of a biscuit! We heard you was dead! Unless you're a bad guy. All right, they're yours. Oh. I'll give you your clothes back. Just don't kill me, please. Okay. I'll make you a deal. Tell me where I can find Carlos and you can run along. Really? Well, hell, I guess I ain't got no option but to trust you. Alright. Carlos said he was making his way into North Vegas, not far south from that home he done stole. Said he was gonna spread justice and the law around like butter on hot toast, I think. I reckon I'm putting my own spin on his words, but that's where you'll find him. Whoa, and so the fastest man ever ran away. Okay, um... Fatigues, flat cap. And we still got our bag. There we go, yay, now I can do stuff. I was in the 33rd Regiment, teaching horses how to play piano. It was one of the times... I was happiest in my life. We had a whole platoon of horses playing pianos on the front lines when I got the call. My wife, a horse, had just died, stampeded by a bunch of coyotes. I shit. I shit everywhere. The horses said I'd shit so much they couldn't play piano no more. That's when my life fell apart. 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 There we go. Okay. Apart. Okay. And where are we going now? Uh, if Carlos is spreading the word of justice, then I have no problem with him. I, in fact, would love to hug him. I almost said kiss. That's too much, though. I need to find a man named Carlos. He's apparently somewhere in North Vegas. <laughs> North Vegas Square. Mm-mm-mm-mm. I just found out I'm a peppermint. Mm, 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 mm. Lick me up and down. Hope this is the right place. Cause if it isn't, I'm gonna punch someone. Preferably that man with no face. Ew. Ew, 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 Listen, Blue Power Ranger. Yeah. No, good. I'm glad you're all as confused as you should be, because that's where the sentence ends. So, you keep looking. Jerry, don't turn Don't turn into the pumpkin man number two, all right? Yeah, you should be disappointed. Okay, let's go. Is this correct, though, or am I going to have to walk through a hundred doors? And... There we go. Ugh, I hate this part of town. A bunch of hobos live here. Don't look at them. No direct eye contact. Oh, great, I have to talk to a hobo. Uh, good morning. I don't have any money or change or valuables. Disregard my clothing. I'm in fact very poor, but not a hobo. I'm not, I'm not that low. So, uh, good lord, you smell. 